Art Gallery. Let us now see some of the famous artists. Asha Bonsley, singer. M. F. Hussain, painter. Amita Bachchan, Javed Akhtar, Arundhati Roy, R. K. Lakshman. Art is as old as human civilization. Let us learn some fascinating facts about art. Early man painted marvelous and astonishingly good paintings on cave walls. Most cave paintings focused on hunters and animals. Early men used natural colors. They drew stick figures for people. but the animals were well drawn and usually filled in with natural colors the prehistoric man also painted the walls of his cave dwellings with scenes showing dancing figures and hunted animals thus art developed many many years ago for instance paintings in bimbetka caves in madhya pradesh are around 10000 years old now we will study about some important equipments tabla it is the major instrument which is used for music brush it is the kind of tool which is used for painting gungru this equipment is used in dancing pen this tool is used for writing mic this instrument is used for singing john milton the great english poet composed several of his poems in the 22 years of his blindness embroidery embroidery is a decoration on a piece of clothing consisting of patterns and pictures made by stitches that are sewn directly into the material embroidery is also a kind of art nowadays embroidery is done with the help of machines too when embroidery is done in the traditional way with hands it is called handicraft papier mache papier mache sometimes called paper mache is a construction material that consists of pieces of paper sometimes reinforced with textiles stuck together using a wet paste the crafted object becomes solid when the paste dries pottery pottery is the ceramic ware made from clay by potters major types of pottery include earthenware stoneware and porcelain the places where such wares are made are called potteries pottery is one of the oldest human technologies and art forms and remains a major industry today block printing wood block printing is a technique for printing text images or patterns used widely throughout east asia and originating in china in antiquity as a method of printing on textiles and later paper ukiyo-e is the best known type of japanese wood block art print tie and dye tie dye is a process of resist dyeing textiles or clothing which is made from knit or woven fabric usually cotton typically using bright colors It is a modern version of traditional dyeing methods used in many cultures throughout the world. Some craft artists recycle objects such as license plates, soda cans, costume jewelry, and old t-shirts into purses and other surprisingly new forms. Bonsai. Bonsai is a form of art. It is the method of growing a very small tree in a small container. The word is pronounced a bonsai. The main definition of bonsai as an outlet for both art and horticulture is quite wide. 
Bonsai originated in China around 1700 years ago. The tree is stopped from growing bigger by continually cutting the roots and branches. In Japanese, bonsai can be literally translated as tree planting. Painting Painting is the practice of applying paint, pigment, color or other medium to a surface. In art, the term describes both the act and the result which is called a painting. Paintings may have for their support such surfaces as walls, paper, canvas, wood, glass, lacquer, clay or concrete. Paintings may be decorated with gold leaf and some modern paintings incorporate other materials including sand, clay and scraps of paper. Mona Lisa is a 16th century portrait painted in oil on a popular panel by Leonardo da Vinci during the Italian Renaissance. Leonardo da Vinci began to work on his masterpiece Mona Lisa in 1503 and completed it three or four years later. The painting is a half-length portrait and depicts a woman whose expression is often described as enigmatic. The ambiguity of the sitter's expression, the monumentality of the half-figure composition and the subtle modeling of forms and atmospheric illusionism were novel qualities that have contributed to the painting's continuing. Bismillah Khan Bismillah Khan, the most outstanding and world-famous Shenai player, has attained astonishing mastery over the instrument. He was born in a small village in Bihar about 60 years ago. He spent his childhood in the holy city of Varanasi. The Shenai is perhaps the most popular of all the instruments in Indian music because it sounds extremely sweet. It is an ancient wind instrument played all over India. Pandit Ravi Shankar is a Bengali Indian sitar player and composer. Ravi Shankar is a leading Indian instrumentalist of the modern era. He has received many awards throughout his career including three Grammy Awards and an Academy Award nomination. In 1999, Ravi Shankar was awarded the Bharat Ratna Award, India's highest civilian honor. Ustad Ali Akbar Khan is a master of the Sarod. His performances worldwide have established the modern Sarod idiom and contributed to greater awareness of Indian classical music. Khan performed all over India to great applause and also travelled the world extensively in the West. In 1956, Khan founded the Ali Akbar College of Music in Kolkata with the mission to teach and spread Indian classical music. Zakir Hussain is a famous Grammy Award winning Indian tabla player. He is widely considered as the world's best tabla player. He has also won national as well as international awards and recognitions for his contribution to the world of music. Odyssey Odyssey is the classical dance style of Orissa, the land of temples, the land of sculptures. The flowing movements and graceful poses of the dance bring to mind the breathtaking beauty of Orissa's temple sculptures. Kathakali Kathakali is a form of Indian dance drama. It originated in the southern Indian state of Kerala during the 17th century. Bharatanatyam Bharatanatyam is a classical dance form originating from Tamil Nadu, a state in southern India. This popular South Indian dance form called Bharatanatyam is a 20th century reconstruction of Kathir, the art of temple dances. Kathak Kathak is one of the classical dance forms of India originally from North India. It is a narrative dance form characterized by fast footwork spins and innovative use of bhav in Abhinaya. Garba 
Garba is an Indian form of dance that originated in the Gujarat region. Unlike other famous types of Indian dance such as Bharatanatyam and Odissi, Garba is much more similar to western social dancing than the presentation style of the others. The greatest difference between Garba and western social dancing is that it is circular and is religious in origin. The Bihu dance is a folk dance from the Indian state of Assam related to the festival of Bihu. This joyous dance is performed by both young men and women and is characterized by brisk dance steps, rapid hand movement and a rhythmic swaying of the hips in order to represent youthful passion. Dancers wear traditionally colorful Assamese clothing. Bhangra is a lively form of music and dance that originated in the Punjab region of India. Guitar and sitar are two instruments that have strings. Piano and harmonium are two instruments that have keys. Harmonium is the one instrument that a singer often plays. Orchestra is a large group of musicians who play different instruments. Harmonica is a small rectangular musical instrument which is played by blowing or sucking air through one of the long sides. Shenai is an instrument which is often played at marriages. Sculptors are artists who make models such as figures carved in wood or stone or cast in metal. A sculptor named Gutson Borgum has carved the heads of four US presidents into the granite rock of Mount Rushmore. Ceramics is used for the making fine pottery using clay. Painted and glazed porcelain was first made in China about 1300 years ago. A fresco is a painting on a wall or ceiling. During the Middle Ages, this was the first form of art. Michelangelo's famous frescoes are in the Sistine Chapel, Rome. Performance by singers, dancers, musicians and actors are collectively referred to as performing arts. Ballet is a type of dance in which carefully organized movements tell a story or express an idea. Now let's learn about some famous artists. Mandolin Vyu Srinivas Upalapu Srinivas, also known as Mandolin Vyu Srinivas, is a musician in the Carnatic musical tradition of southern India. He came to prominence not only for his playing but for his choice of instrument, an electric mandolin. Vyu Srinivas made his first public Carnatic concert performance in 1978 in Gudivada, Andhra Pradesh. M.S. Subbulakshmi Madurai Shanmugavarivu Subbulakshmi, popularly known as M.S., was a renowned Carnatic vocalist. She was the first musician ever to be awarded the Bharat Ratna, India's highest civilian honor. She gave her first public performance during the Mahamaham festival at Kumbakonam at the age of 16. Shivkumar Sharma Pandit Shivkumar Sharma is an Indian classical musician of Hindustani classical music tradition. He is a master of the Santur, who used to be only a folk instrument from the valley of Kashmir. Shivkumar is the first musician to play Indian classical music on Santur. Elton John Sir Elton Hercules John is an English singer, songwriter, composer and pianist. In his four-decade career, John had been one of the dominant forces in rock and popular music, especially during the 1970s. He has won five Grammy Awards and one Academy Award. John started playing the piano at the age of three and within a year, his mother heard him picking. Mural a large picture which is painted on a wall is called a mural. Mosaic 
Sometimes the pictures is made by fixing pieces of pottery glass or stones onto the wall is called mosaic. Painting A painting is a picture made with paints. There are many kinds of paints which artists use are oil colors, watercolors and acrylic colors. Pottery Making things out of clay and then coloring them is done all over the world. Sculpture A sculpture is a statue made from any material like metal, wood, stone, animal bone or even ice. A sculpture carves the statue from these materials. Illustrations Drawings in books and magazines are called illustrations. Digital art Art made with the help of computer are called digital art. Kids Here we can learn about some famous Indian artist. Ustad Alaraka was a master of the tabla a classical Hindustani percussion instrument. Alaraka was born as Alaraka Kureshi at Pagwal village near Jammu, India. M.S. Gopalakrishnan is one of the well-known violinists of the 20th century in the field of Carnatic music. He is a recipient of the prestigious Sangeeta Kalanidhi Award in 1997. T. N. Krishnan Tripunitra Narayanan Krishnan is a Carnatic music violinist. He won the National Award for the Sangeet Natak Academy in 1974. Later, he was awarded Sangeeta Kalanidhi in 1980. Ustad Vilayat Khan was one of the India's well known sitar maestros. Born in Gauripur in Myanmar Singh, Bengal. Pannalal Ghosh was known as Amal Jyoti Ghosh, was a Bengali Indian flute player and composer. Born in Barisal, East Bengal, now Bangladesh. T.R. Mahalingam is a Kollywood actor, singer and music composer of the 1940s and 1950s. In 1937, at the age of 14, Mahalingam got the chance to appear in the film called Nandakumar. The film was based on the story of Lord Krishna, wherein Mahalingam was chosen to play the lead role. Here are names of some famous Indian classical dancers. Rukmini Devi Arundel was an Indian theophist, dancer, and choreographer in Indian classical dancer form of Bharatanatyam. Dr. Sonal Man Singh is an eminent Indian classical dancer and choreographer of Odyssey dancing style, who is also proficient in other Indian classical dancing styles, including Bharatanatyam, Kuchipudi, and Chow. Pandit Shambhu Maharaj was a celebrated guru of the Lucknow Gharana of the Indian classical dance form Kathak. He was born in Lucknow. Sitara Devi is an eminent Indian dancer of the classical Kathak style of dancing. When she was in her teens, Rabindranath Tagore, after watching a performance by her, described her as Nritya Samragini, meaning the Empress of Dance. Raja and Radha Reddy, the world famous dancing couple, excel in the art of Kuchipudi. Both of them were born in the state of Andhra Pradesh. Raja Reddy was born in 1944 in Narsapur and Radha Reddy in 1952 in Kotalgaon. Kelucharan Mohapatra 
was an Indian classical dancer, guru and proponent of Odyssey dancer. Let us learn some of important facts. Ko is a major school of floral art in Japan. Floral design is the art of using plant materials and flowers to create a pleasing and balanced composition. Cameo is a small carved gem. Cameo is a method of carving or an item of jewelry or vessel made in this manner. Su Chao is a form of embroidery which originated in China. Embroidery is the art or handicraft of decorating fabric or other materials with needle and thread or yarn. The early Chinese used Indian ink for drawing and lettering. Indian ink or less commonly called Chinese ink since it may have been first developed in either India or China, is a simple black ink once widely used for writing and printing. Raphael, Leonardo da Vinci and Michelangelo are known as the trinity of art. Raphael Sanzio was an Italian painter and architect. Leonardo da Vinci was an Italian polymath, being a scientist, mathematician, engineer, inventor, anatomist, painter, sculptor, architect, botanist, musician and writer. Michelangelo was an Italian Renaissance painter, sculptor, architect, poet and engineer. Musical instruments have been classified into three groups.